Just got here with the squad. Gang, gang. Why are you guys so quiet? What's up, man? What's up, guys? What's up? I can't put in the wrong hole. The wrong hole dude. Yeah. Yeah, that feels real good. Feels real good. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. Right. It doesn't even look like you guys touched Done. it. All right. So you're just gonna put uh, just the driver's seat? Yeah, the passenger, we still have to figure out um, because there's like a weight sensor, so then I haven't read much mm. about it. So, then so I wanna see what the weight sensor is only on that side? It's no. on that side, yeah, okay. because then it's for this room. Right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so somebody, uh, they, they, people still haven't figured out how to uh, successfully uh, mm -hmm. wire it, so that's. Well, oh, I mean, the SRS bag here is gone though. Mm. Yeah, so because uh, there's a resistor that you install, mm -hmm. so then the, the airbag light won't be on, but but then this light, you can't get rid of it. Yeah, yeah. That's okay. Hey you guys, look at that. Mugen on Mugen on Mugen on Mugen. Before you know it, I bet you he's gonna have the hood. <laughs> Frank disconnected the battery and forgot to. <laughs> Is it on? You could smell that mugen, man. Oh, it's this rail right here. We gotta pull out. It's a piece Did you? Of... You already installed it? Yeah, somewhat? it's a PCI rail. It was all in pieces. Mm-hmm. Damn, boys. Can we just see the backside? I know. It's 11 pounds. That's true. 11 pounds. Well, you can't do. I don't think you could do this with the stock. This one. And in the back is a full fiberglass. Super, Super clean, man. Pretty cool seat. Well, I mean, they it was manufactured with the carbon back for a long time. Mm -hmm. But then they stopped. Maybe because people weren't buying it. Because um, obviously with the carbon, they charged a lot more. Mm -hmm. yeah, Probably like so another 500 a piece? No, more than that, dude. Wow. The carbon one costs as much as two of these. Wow. So it's just not worth it. Yeah, because how out. much how much more weight are you gonna lose with the carbon? You know, a lot more. Maybe like not, well, this maybe is already, this FRP, is already not, dude. This, this is, is already like fiberglass, right? I don't even know what the weight of this is, but it's it's not heavy, dude. Look, it's yeah, so, so. Sexy seat, dude. What is it? Uh, it's probably like a, it's like twelve pounds or something. Yeah, I, I, I don't even know what it is. I think it was. I looked it up today because I was like, curious on the price. I think it was five point three kilos or something like that. Yeah, kil kilograms, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's about a seat. So Ricardo produces it for uh, Megan. Okay. It's cool how it's like the old school, um, yeah, the, the Mugen, Mugen old school Mugen logo. Four big bolts and yeah, then... it's a Torx. So, all right, I got the negative off. Let's see. I think it's a T50. I don't know if they have a Torx here. Oh yeah, it's right here. 50. I think 50 or 55. Let me see. It's mm. one of these. Oh, fuck. Oof. I didn't strip it. I want to make sure I don't strip it, though. Yeah. So should you should have just done regular bolts. I know, dude. Fuck. Like, why make them pretty, pretty bolts? If most That's going to be hard, dude. Yeah. Unless, there's a, unless we have an impact. It's a B. What is that? It's a B. Yeah, it's a B. It looks like a B. Frank, man, your 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 car is a bug monster, man. We seen the weirdest bugs. No, this car. one looks transformer, dude. <laughs> All is right. That breaker boy? Hey, get get something. I'll keep on taking nine. You guys just watch it. So it wasn't that bad. 
it's just, like, it's just like any other car. Yeah. It's just that it's instead of a regular bolt, they yeah, use. It's a torch. Mm -hmm. I don't know why they don't just use a, uh, a regular phone. Because they wanted it to be like pretty it's secure, pretty washers or something. So there's one clip. It's kind of hard. How do we? Uh, so we gotta take everything underneath that seat and put on that one. We have to Not transfer it? some stuff. Yeah, I don't know what it is yet, but here, bend it. Bend this more. So. You should have more clearance now. There's no bug in here. No, there is, dude. No, man, there's no bug. Black one's giving me a little bit of trouble. It's right here. It's the black one. We gotta remove this. Then we gotta remove one more down here. Let me check it out. If it doesn't have a seat, we'll get it later. Yeah, okay, you want me to go forward? Dude, it's not in here. Wow. It's underneath your carpet, bro. Popping yeah. eggs. Probably under the Mugen carpet. <laughs> Check under the carpet. Maybe, maybe it went I like. No. Wait, is this Mugen carpet? No. <laughs> 20, 20, 20 I got one already. Could you pop the seat more back or no? Oh uh, no! It actually, already has tension on it. Yeah. Get that fucking bug, dude. There we go. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. All right. Lay it flat. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Weave it out this way. Yeah. Yeah. You that just, might be better. Like, we just do this. And then I'll, I'll be yeah. on the other side. Yeah, and then, like. And just be careful with the rails, dude. I don't want to stretch. Yeah, see if you could. Uh... So let's lay it flat more. Hold on. Yeah. Like that. Yeah. And then just Try lift it. it up. You got it? Yeah. You got it? Yeah. You're all receiving. Oh, sure. Hold on. 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 Hold <laughs> right. He was right here, dude, the whole fucking time. All right, I got him. All right, go. I feel better. Do you feel like a man now? Yes. You got the bug, <laughs> dude. I don't know what the fuck that was, man. <laughs> oh shit! Here we go. Oh, he's, uh, <laughs> there's another bug right here. <laughs> hey, I guess Mugen just calls for bugs, man. That's a spider. <laughs> All right, uh, let's go look at the bottom side of this seat. So there's a few things we have to remove this. So do you have the bolt for this? Right here. You want a seat belt? It looks like a 14, 15. 14. Let's get a job, Frankie. Alright. Alright. Nice. Alright, so that's one thing that has to The seatbelt sensor. So the belt has to come up with the take out. It's all right here. It's snake tinder. Mm. You need so, a pick tool. Yeah, so it comes off here. Right, let me see where my pick tools. Alright, just comes off there, comes off here. Alright. Yep, it's loose, so I need it. This one right here. Oh, oh shit, I shouldn't have broke that. I broke it. So this has to come off. Yeah, this has to come off and move with the rail, which is this. Yep. This tells the car how forward and back um you are to the Alright, so there's a few more things that I need to take off this. You gotta remove all this. Yeah, I'll, I'll do it later. There you go. Okay. I think he's just impatient and trying to just like. No, man, when it comes to Frank's car, he's super patient. No, I should have been more patient with that clipper here, though. <laughs> Shit just. He just, he just pulled on it. Yep. Hey, man, we got that bug, and that's all that matters. There it is. There you go. Done. Alright, so. Mm 
Like, all right, so, so let's not lose that. Yeah, let's so uh, this is a sensor. Where's that, where's that this what is the sensor that tells the car how far forward. So we gotta take this off. The train says so. There's three cables underneath. This the, one has to be transferred. Yeah. So he's gonna. This tells you what, how close you are to the uh, the, the airbag. airbag. Yeah. How far forward you are to the airbag. The blue one is the seatbelt. The yellow one is the airbag. Um. Seems like it's better just buy all these clips now. Yeah. It might save you time if you just break it. Crash on when you get T-boned. The pillar. It pops on the side. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Yeah. You know that. You don't transfer this though, obviously, because it stays there, right? Yeah. This is the only thing that we need to take. Dude, but I'm having trouble here. Clearly, we could just cut this out. Oh. Yeah. Because we're not going to reuse it. There's no There's no attachments to yeah, that. Yeah, because all of Same these. Same thing with this, you know? Yeah. Just be careful not to cut yeah, the not, line though, Yeah, dude. I don't want to do that. I have double tape to Actually. That's good. Yeah, that's you fine. Make it, right? yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. That's good. So just pull it out this way. Yeah, so this, right, there it is, easy money, like that, just exactly how, exactly how it was, but the only thing is, where's the, how does it bolt into the, wait, I think he needs to buy a nut for this, for, for what nut, well, how is this going to stay on, right, what, you had the nut, hey Anthony, I have it, it's at my house, I remember now, <laughs> so, what are you guys taking? My bad, dude. Yeah. How far? Uh, Alright, guys. So, um, Frank pulled the mission back to his house because uh, he kind of forgot the nut that goes here. So, as you guys can see, it's not mounted. Um, so he went home to go get it, but, um, it's getting pretty late and, uh, I gotta head out. I get, wake up early in the morning, but yeah, these are the seats. Probably next time I see Frank, this is probably going to be installed because they're going to try to finish it tonight. But, um, just a conclusion to take off the seat, you pretty much, uh, take off the four bolts. So you got one, two, three, four. And then um, you use a T55, if I recall. And then after that, you kind of just flip it around. You you disconnect the three plugs. So you got one plug. The, you got the white plug, blue plug, and the yellow, uh, yellow plug. Because you're running aftermarket seats, you can't really... It doesn't come with the air, <laughs> airbag, pretty much. So you put a resistor so it at least notifies the ECU, the computer system, to know like that it is there. So you gotta pretty much install this as per the um, Japanese instructions say. You just gotta put the resistor, connect it there, and uh, it's good to go. But so yeah, so pretty much uh, once they get back, do the seatbelt. After the seatbelt, tighten everything put this on there and then he's just going to adjust it to wherever he wants and then after that you know we could just slap it on the car so i uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to leave a comment let me know if you guys would get a mugen seat or would just just get the recaro the regular recaro one for your type r obviously this piece is super nice i would love to have it i bet rob would love to have it i do <laughs> but oh my god but for sure I'm gonna take Frank's other one now. Yeah. <laughs> Frank has two, so. Yeah. Cause... Frank, you, I'm gonna grab your other seat, so you're gonna have to be stuck with the red one for a while. Yeah, so Frank did buy two seats, but t for today, we're just working on the driver's seat, because he, it's much more simpler uh, than the passenger side, because the passenger side, you do need the, uh, you also need additional cables and a bracket for the weight system, because um, that's how the passenger airbag works for the, for that side hopefully you guys don't stay up too late like yesterday hopefully it's not another 2 a.m morning <laughs> yeah they, these guys were here two in the morning yesterday doing the act the install the for frank on this car you guys enjoyed this video as as we said and uh yeah, make sure make sure to subscribe for more type r content they actually might be coming already i hear them the question is do oh. we stay to get the full video or do we go home to be responsible like how we should be? <laughs>
responsibility <laughs> to leave. Yeah. Like <laughs> this is what's holding us up, dude. I know. Oh, there it is. This little thing I fucking forgot. Two hours later you finally found you found it. Stupid. <laughs> I'm assuming. So it's gonna be here. Let's just put it on the highest position for now. I'm not I don't I don't really care to be super low. I heard that even though it's at the highest, it's still low. Mm. Okay, so then this goes in like that to yep. protect the seat. Yeah, that's pretty much it. And then it came with all that hardware? No, this is from you have to buy this. Oh, but you bought a bunch of it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you because of you it's you got short ones and long ones. <laughs> well, I I don't know. You know, like I just bought the kit, it came with it. Oh, okay. Yeah. So because <laughs> I'm like, wait, if you went to Ace Hardware and bought all this hardware <laughs> Imagine. Like, you're you're mad at yourself and like, why do I have long ones? <laughs> Yeah, so then now we could mount the front ones much easier. 